Hey guys, Dr. Jeff Glover here with Glover Chiropractic Clinic. Now we are still closed, so we're gonna be continuing on with our educational series of videos uh, that we just started a couple days ago. So we're gonna go over different topics because I ask you guys to call, call in, give us messages, see what you wanna hear. Now today what we're gonna go over is we're gonna go over the best sleep posture, okay? Now sleep is very important. Whenever we sleep, that's when the body heals itself. And if you're not getting the appropriate time or quality of sleep, then that's going to affect how you can fight off different things that are constantly trying to attack us, okay? So I'm going to go over the top two sleep postures that you should be sleeping in to get you the most rest, okay? And I'm going to have my wife, Jada, is going to be the model for us. Jada, come on in. Mm -hmm. Okay, go ahead and see here first. Now this is my lovely, beautifully talented wife, Jada, for those of you who might not have seen the first video. So we're going to go over two different sleeping techniques, okay? The first one is gonna be the best one to help rehydrate your discs at night. Now, your spinal column is made up of vertebra or bones and discs. So how it goes is you have a vertebra, then you have a disc, a vertebra, and another disc. Now, the disc is the shock absorbers of our spine. So, and as we go throughout the day, we constantly have gravity putting pressure on us this way, okay? And whenever we sleep, the body tries to rehydrate those discs. Now this sleep posture I'm about to show you is the best way to do that, okay? Now it's lying on your side with a pillow between your knees, okay? So I'm gonna have Jada, go ahead, you don't mind lying on your side for me. Okay. So you're gonna be side lying just like this, and you're gonna take a pillow and you're gonna put it right between your knees. Now it doesn't have to be a specially made pillow, just something to give your knees a little bit of separation, okay? Because the whole idea is we don't want our knees coming too far down, making a, a weird angle with our hips here. So we want to have a little bit of separation there, okay? And now also too, if you look at Jada from the side, we want everything to be nice and straight, okay? That straight line, that's gonna give us a neutral position and it's gonna help rehydrate that disc at night. Well, all your disc. So this is the number one way, okay? Number two way is on your back with a pillow underneath your knees. And I'm going to show you that now. Okay, Jada, get my lane on your back. And this is a special pillow I'm going to talk about in just a second. Okay. And then we're going to have a pillow right underneath here. Okay, so what we want to do, this is the pillow I'm going to talk about once, once we're done here. We want to have a pillow underneath your neck so that supports your curve of your neck and then also a pillow underneath your knees so you get a little bit of a bend in your knees. Whenever you do that, it takes the pressure off your low back. Okay. This is the number two way you want to sleep. Now, some people, for whatever reason, may have a CPAP machine, may have certain things where they can't lie on their side, then this is the go-to position. One of the things you want to not do is lay on your stomach. Laying on your stomach is going to be bad. Put your back into extension and makes the holes where the nerves go through get smaller. So it pinches those nerves and can aggravate your low back, okay? So number one is on your side with a pillow between your knees. Number two is on your back with a pillow underneath your knees, okay? Go ahead and sit up. And now I want to talk a little bit about this pillow. You might have saw me open this up. Now, this is a new pillow that just came on the market. And I've been using it for probably what, a month and a half, two months, something like that. Okay. The name of it is called a dinner roll pillow. Now, most of the time, I'm not one to endorse products because I don't want people to think I have a vested interest in the company because I don't. But what happens is this one is really good for people with neck issues. Okay especially people who have a loss of curve in their neck. You're supposed to have a, a curve in your neck kind of like a backward C. A lot of times people will have that neck straightened out because they'll get a condition called text neck where we're constantly looking at our phones. When we look at our phones, what happens is our head comes forward, okay? And this helps prevent that. Now you saw how when Jada was lying down, I opened up this part right here, okay? There's a spot where you can open up and then your head lies right in through there so there's a neutral position in through there. Now there's a special device right in through here this is called the dinner roll. It's called D-E-N-N-E-R roll, okay? So it's like the dinner roll you eat, but it's spelled a little bit different, okay? And what this is, this is a spinal molding device, so it helps to put that curve back in your neck, okay? Um, and this goes inside that pillow there. You use a regular pillowcase for it, and you can use it sideline or on your back, so it works really good. Now, and if you're interested in those, you can contact Contact us or you can contact your local chiropractor. It's just now coming out. It's by a company called uh, CBP, stands for Chiropractic Biophysics, but it's really cool. And most of them, they uh, 
don't have dog hair on them, but we've got a few, do a few dogs here. So, uh, but that works really good. So uh, the crux of the story is sideline is best for your sleep. On your back is number two. And so those are gonna be two best ways. And I think Gunner's coming this way too. Hey buddy, play. So we're watching Gunner too, so he may be doing a drive by here. So he went by but didn't make the jam. Okay. All right. So that was the video on sleep pasture. We're gonna do a couple more videos too. Um, but this was the one I thought that most people could use because you want to take this time to make sure you're getting the most quality of sleep that you can so your immune system can function as good as it can. All right, that's it for now, guys. All right, thanks. Have a good one.